Hey, welcome back to our car application. So I've got on the screen here the assignment in the written form. And what I'd like you to do is to take a look at the challenge areas. So what page are we on? It looks like about a page 11. So on this, I'd like you to add two new properties. So what does your car need to have to make it a little bit more, um, I guess, interesting? So make, model, and price are what we have now. So create another two properties. Add the color of the car or the year of the car, or the miles on the car. Or how about a Boolean value? Is new, which should be true or false. The size of the engine, which is measured in the liters of the car, so the displacement of the cylinders. So a small car is like a 1.2 liter engine, and a large truck might be seven or eight liters. The body condition, you can give it as a, like a ranking from one to 10. So pick some properties. Uh, you don't have to use the ones that I suggest, but pick two. And so then we're going to add that to the car CS file and also add it to the program to accommodate these. The second challenge is that our program will crash. If you try to put in a string where it's expecting a number, it'll die. So the case where you see parse int is where you're going to have a lot of uh, program crashes. And so what do we do to fix that? Well, there is something called try catch. So do some Google searching to see what try catch is about, see some examples, and that'll prevent your application from crashing. So also to see uh, what happens if you do an out of range. So for instance, it says if you have, let's say, three cars in your car inventory and you try to buy car number 99, see what happens. You'll get an out of range error. So I want you to fix that too. So how do you check for an out of range on the value of, a, of an array? So fix these errors and so that way the program works better. So that's a big part of your research and uh, make the program uh, your own.